What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back on Black Desert, continuing the Nova, level 49 now. So uh, yeah, we are making the progression. I have not been to a town for very long, so obviously we've got a crap load of crap. Just everywhere. We got gold bars, tons of gold bars. Is this a mil per? We got 10 mil. We've got 27 mil in the inventory. We are just packing right now. We got all sorts of random crap. Weight limit, looking fine, so we're not too concerned about that. But yes, got all sorts of garbage in here. We can toss these golden pigs, not lock. We can toss these golden pigs blessings on out of, on out of the inventory. And I'll move that up there and I'll move the clear memory piece up there. And... Uh... Let's just move this up here for now. Okay, let's do this. So now we are at one of my favorite spots in the entire game. Wish it was like a later game farm spot because I really do love Lake Kaya, one of my favorite spots. And so, yeah, we get to do that today. It's just really good. There's tons of enemies here. We should be able to get to 50 today. So that'll be great. All right, slam, get that going. Still, I can't say that I got a whole lot of weapon practice. Like, I would li like to say that through all of this, that um, powering up to where we are now, that I got a bunch of practice with the character, but I really didn't because it's a lot of, like, single enemy. Other than Kur uh, Kuratos or whatever they're called, other than those, it's pretty dead, like, in terms of... Um, how much effort and enemies there are to fight. Like, there just isn't that many. It's a lot of just simple, go do this quest, kill a couple enemies here. That's really why a lot of the times I see it, it ends up skipping here, because it's just boring. Like, no one needs to see me grind off against uh, random enemies for two minutes before we move on to the next location. Like, at least with here, there's enemies. Like, there's a significant amount of enemies, and there's a significant amount to kill. Now, why our skin, obviously, is the main quest, and we did finish that up really quickly, but there's these side quests here that are very good, that I very much enjoy. So, we're gonna get to level 50 here fairly easily, as you can see. I have to figure out where... I think he's back in this corner. Let me kill these. There's a there's an actual quest here. Um, maybe not this quest. Oh, wait. It is this corner right here. So we can turn in the main quest oh, and then... Um, I don't know what my phone is doing. <laughs> we can... Um, we can pick up his side quests, which are actually fairly good. The Defeat the Fisherman quest. Very good. There's all sorts of Defeating Fisherman quests around here that are repeatable. And so, yeah, I just think... I just think this area ends up being one of the better spots in the game. Now maybe as I get later on in Sork and I find some new spots, my opinion will change, but I just really I just really think it's a good spot. There's good mob density, you can go mob to mob fairly easily. There's not a There's nothing too overwhelming here. I don't know why it took me there first, but it's all kind of laid out decently if you want to do a circle. I end up doing kind of this, like, awkward... You don't have to come down this strip, but there's a decent amount of enemies down here, and that's why I do end up doing it. But overall, you don't need to come down here, but you can just run that circle. But this ends up working out fairly well because there's just a ton of enemies down here, and that's what I like so much. I don't know which one did I pick. Oh, Catfisherman 1. So we need to fight. We need to kill 30. Is that just regular catfish? I don't think I'll do the full. I think there's like. We got the Naru ring. I think there's. What do I want to say? I think there's four stages to that quest. Which is a lot. And definitely don't need to do all of those. But. They're really good. Like, they're definitely probably worth doing. They were definitely worth doing, like, at the very beginning of the game, because I felt like you leveled up a little bit slower, and so I felt like you spent more time here. 
But you can grind here um, probably 50. I think it's like 52. I think I grinded here to 52 once. I'll get those numbers more down as I... Because I think the next character I do, whether it's Ranger or whoever it ends up being, I don't think I'm going to just straight run the story. I think I'm going to try to... Um, just level up by farming different areas. Because we have all that gear saved now at uh, Hydel that I just don't think I need to... I think I can... I think I can just skip the story if I want to. Which I think we need to do once or twice. Because I always do the story and I think it's a little bit pointless. But the point is, is that I'll get these, these spots down a little bit more. Because obviously I have my favorite spots right now. I should probably figure out what's optimal. Which I have been working on. I, I'm trying to watch more Black Desert videos. Um... I kind of have a schedule of videos I'm going to start watching, not pertaining to Black Desert specifically, just in general, that I watch kind of the YouTube videos. I have an, So I have an hour for lunch when I work, um, and so I watch some of the videos that I really like at lunch, and then before bed I catch up on MMO news, and then I catch up on, I'm going to try to start to watch like one Black Desert video a night before I go to bed, because I stay up and watch stuff every night, like, I think I get, so I get into bed, like, midnight, and I usually fall asleep by, like, one, but that's, that's, like, an hour of video watching, but the point is, is that I'm gonna be able to get some stuff figured out for future stuff, and just combos and stuff, I wanna, I've got, like, a Nova video on the docket, actually finally using that, uh, <laughs> watch a later, um, playlist on YouTube, so, trying my best to get more used to all the characters and get combos down and all that different stuff. So I'm not just a noob slamming the one button, because that's what I feel like now that I came back. I know I was kind of like that before, but I had gotten some combos down, especially with Sword. Okay, so we are... I should probably stop killing stuff. Hold on, let's go back to him. We did complete all the quests, but let me go back to him. We might complete one more. I know one's, like, kill, like, 300, so that's that's a while. And accept the new main quest. We'll go to at least the bot. Dude. Can you guys leave me alone? Okay. So quest 52, or number 2, and then number 3. You can accept both of those at the same time. And then I think... Yeah, that one, this one's not bad. Okay. Let's go up here. I really like... I gotta... Yeah, the ice... Someone said I'd really like the ice with the Nova, and I really do. I need to... Hold on. What am I doing? I'm not leveling up because I didn't pop the piece. Hold on. Let me go up in this corner. I think they'll follow me, but I should be able to... I think... Can I pop it fast enough? There we go. Okay. I thought I popped it. Hold on. Okay, I popped it. Now, how do I get to... Honestly, oh, I gotta do this. I gotta go to the Black Spirit and confirm this. Does he have any side quests I need to do? No. Okay, so now I should be able to get to 50. The next enemy I kill should get me to 50, I think. Yep, there's 50. Okay. Nice. Okay, didn't do my... Oh yeah, and I definitely need to do some new skills, because I have not used, like, any skill points since, like, very early in the game. It's been a really long time since I used skills. I don't know what the sage is doing. He's, he, like, watched me kill those guys. This was the one, this was the one annoying part about, um, this area, Lake Kaya, was because... It was main story, and this part right here is the best part to farm, but if there's someone else here with you, it's just not, it's not as good, obviously. But it, it like, becomes really clustery, especially if that person's not running, like, an actual route, they're just running around killing stuff. 
it ends up making things a little bit, like, clunky, awkward. Like, if they kind of stick to their own circle on that side of the map, and, and you can run your circle over here, it's really not that bad, but it's when they're, like, just randomly going mob to mob and there's no, like, rhyme or reason to it, they, it makes this, like, almost unfarmable because these guys have a decent cooldown. So you have to, like, wait. So what do we have to do? We have to... We need the steel baskets from... I remember the elite fisherman baskets used to be so stupid. They used to take absolutely forever to get kills. Or to get the kills to get that unlocked. I just remember it was horrid. It was absolutely horrid the amount of like kills you had to get to get it. Somehow missed him. Yeah, see, that guy like ran a weird like pattern here. Yeah, see, he's up. He was he went up in there, but he didn't clear down here, which is fine. Why did it not do my normal? These three guys, which I think... Do we still need the fishermen? Yeah, we do, so... Good thing I turned back for that guy. I thought I missed him. Got blocked by the wall there. Or, not even a wall, it was just like... The fishing nets. So we just need the basic, the basic catfish. Like this dude. That attack is so good if you can get a large pack chasing you. That's just so good. We need one more fisherman. We need eight more witness catfishmen. We need six more fat catfishmen. And one more um, of the elite fishers. I don't think if I kill that guy, that counts. That's the only reason I skipped him. Okay, good. My ah, uh, he's coming kind of over. Okay. Dude, leave me alone. Okay, I'm gonna let him have that. I'm gonna go back over here. I want to hope to say that he eh, kind of let him respawn. I need to kill these guys up here on the ridge that I need to complete the quest before someone else comes over here. There we go. Let's see. Guess I'll head... Oh, well, I'll kill this guy. We're kind of solo hunting out guys now because I need to make sure I complete what I need to complete here. Let's go back over here. Where are we at? We need five more witnesses. We need one more fisher and one more fat. You're the last fat I needed. Okay. Okay, so there's two up here that I need. Let's get up here before someone else does. Okay, so now we need two more witness. And we need one more... We still need one more... Okay, there's... So we need one more witness, and we need one more... Okay, we need no more witness now. Come on, fishermen. Get, uh, elite... Oh, I have to go find elite fishermen. These aren't elite. Um, okay, so there's one on my map. Gotta get to them quick. There's two on my map. Can this one just give it to me? There we go. Okay. So I'm gonna go turn these in. We did get to... We did get a decent way to 50. I don't know if those guys will protect me while I'm talking to him. So there's those two quests. He has one more defeat. Catfishman 4. Okay, they don't do anything helpful. And then let's grab the main quest. That's in progress. And then I still needed to grab this. They knocked me out of accepting it. Okay. I think, yeah, it's just killed 300 Catfishmen. Which... 
normally I would be all game for, but I don't really think we, I don't really think we need to do it. I honestly, I just don't think we need to do it. Let's turn this into Petraeo. I don't know if we're at boss or not. I think we are at boss. Yes. So we are at the boss now. I'm going to go ahead and skip. I don't think we need to. We're 50. We're, we're going to get to mid 50, almost 51. I mean, I'll swing away at a couple here, but I think we're pretty good. I don't know how to... Oh, it's out in the middle. I forgot. Okay. I'm just going to jump in and swim. Even though swimming is so egregiously slow. But, yeah, I just don't think... I don't think any more that killing the 300 there. It gives you a fair reward. I think it could give you a better reward, but it's fair. Um, but I don't think it's worth the time or the effort on it, so I just don't do it anymore. It used to be, like, necessary, because you used to get here... Okay, can I really not pick myself up? Really, game? Okay. Let me go around this way. Um, but yeah, you used to have to... You used to have a lot harder of a time getting to 50. But I didn't even really grind any spots. I grinded, like, a spot for a very small amount of time. And then grinded another spot for a very small amount of time. And that was about it. You used to have to, like, actually put some effort into grinding. I think maybe it has to do with new server. And I just... And not as time wasty on, on stuff as I used to be. But, I don't know. I don't feel like it's that drastic of a difference. But maybe it is. Maybe it is. But okay, there's that done. I need Petraeo to spawn in here. Hello? Is he gonna, is he gonna spawn? Is he gonna load in? There he is. And then we have to go back to shore. We have some other quests to complete. And then I'm not sure. I don't remember what's next. Oh, yes. I do remember what's next. Rudum Sentry Outpost. Which, not a terrible... I gotta remember how to go back to... Because we have quests to turn in here. Yeah, back over here. I have these double quests to turn in. So I'm gonna go do that. And then... Where's the Rudum Sentry Outpost? I need to... Wait, where's the Rudum Sentry Outpost? Okay, well, I'll see you at the Rudum Sentry Outpost, I think. I'm gonna turn these quests in, and then we'll head over there, and then I'm guessing I'll wrap up the episode from there. But I could be wrong. But, yeah, I'll see you guys over there. Uh, not necessarily at the Outpost, but the next eventful thing that we can do to, you know, that's more entertaining than watching me swim through the swamp. So I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, here we go. We are back. We need to attack the Rudum outstation, get these kills. Um, I don't know how many, how much experience these guys give, so we'll find out. If they give a good amount, we might even get to 51 here, which that would be great. Um, I'm gonna be completely honest. Tomorrow we may be in jeopardy for an episode. Um, I don't know. I've just been feeling, like, ridiculously tired the last couple of days i just like hit a wall like i felt i feel good and then like i don't know different different points in the day i just hit a wall and i hit a wall today i i watched the end of a uh, the james madison south sam houston state game and then i came back to record this video and i just feel like hot trash so tomorrow's video might be in jeopardy but I think we're coming up on PSO2, uh, New Genesis Beta. Uh, that should be on Friday, I believe. And so I believe either Monday or tomorrow, I will have a PSO2 video starting. Um, I don't know what we're going to do because I don't want to upload like seven videos a day because I just think that's dumb. So... Yeah, I want to do, like, one a couple of videos there, like, hey, yeah, let's get ready for the PSO2 New Genesis beta and play PSO2, because I'm, I I own PSO2, so we might as well play it. I don't even remember if that game was buy to play. I think, was it free? It was free. But point is, is that's, that, that's coming. 
And then that series will probably continue, and I'll just turn it into, you know, preparing for PSO2, New Genesis, instead of the beta, but... Yeah. I think, I think, I think that's gonna happen. But I don't know what that means for, for this series. But we'll, I mean, we'll finish the series, obviously, I'm not, like, quitting it. But it might take a couple of days off again. But that's okay. We'll get, we'll, we'll get back to it. Okay, we are leveling up a little bit slower st now, but not terrible. At some point, we're gonna have to... We're gonna have to get... We're gonna have to go for a grind fest episode, which is what I was trying to get to, but... Right now, we're still a little bit... Kinda working our way through this. I kind of, the, the date kind of snuck up on me, that's kind of why, because I kind of thought I had longer before the PSO2 New Genesis beta, but really don't, that thing comes out soon. And I want to play it, because I really like PSO2, but I didn't like the hub, the hub-based instances, I like the more open world like this, how Black Desert is. I want, like, quests and, like, stuff like that. Is this a... Okay, no. I thought that was, like, a big, like, boss almost out of me. It wasn't. Uh, but, yeah. I... I want quests and, like, good stuff like that to do, but I don't want it to be hub-based. It's not my favorite thing. And I would continue my character. Uh, we might continue the character that we already have, but I don't remember how to play the PS2. I didn't play it like I played this game, where I have, like... 300 hours or something. I probably have more than that into this game. And so, I don't remember how to play it. Like, I kind of remember how to play this game, but that's a whole different... That's a whole That's a whole different thing we got going on over there. So, I'm going to slaughter this group of enemies up here, and then we will call it an episode. Um, just because I don't know when the next thing is. And if you, if you know about about football in Sam Houston State and James Madison, it's like 6 o'clock, so if I want to get this up at our usual upload time of 8 o'clock, don't have a ton of time. So, yes. So tomorrow's video, I'm sure I'll will myself up in the morning and we'll get a video made. Um, Microsoft actually sent me two Xbox Series S's, so I have to go pick that up tomorrow. But yeah, so I'll get up, I'll record probably maybe a video of this or maybe pso2 we'll see but i'll catch you guys i'll see you all tomorrow eight o'clock eastern for a video hope you guys come back and check it out i'll catch you guys then peace